What's up guys, Henry and WR Free here with a new video for you today, and today I have a treat for you. Today we're going to look at the new Oliver for the Take and Play range. This has been a really big one I've been looking for, along with Bert. i not found Bert yet, but we found Oliver, so we're going to take a look at him today. It's a packaging, all its glorious details. So guys, let's get Oliver out of the box. Little known fact about Oliver, Oliver is actually named after the Reverend W. Audrey, one of his neighbors, I believe, and same thing with Mavis. Oliver and Mavis were from the same household. So, that's a really interesting thing to note. But guys, Oliver is one of my favorite characters, so I've been really highly anticipating this release. And here is Oliver. He does seem very cool indeed. But, there are some gripes I do have with the model. Alright, one thing is that I do believe these back wheels should have made, been made a little bit smaller. I know they have smaller wheels from looking at the miniature engines, for example. So I believe that should have been made. But that's not a huge, that's not a huge, huge thing. It's just like a little bit weird to look at. And he does seem a little bit squashed in. Now then, I think that is a little bit strange, but he still looks like Oliver at the end. And the 11, it's not supposed to go there, guys. It's not supposed to go there. But either way, guys, Oliver does look a very nice little take-and-play model. Indeed, he does have a lot of detail for being squashed up. And I do think he would be a nice little engine to add to your take-and-play collection. Either way, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a good day.